Hey everybody, welcome to Rob Squad and the Creators. We are so excited. We have another special guest, but it is a duo as special guests that we have heard so much about. And today we get the honor of interviewing them and listen to their music for the very first time. But if you guys are new here, you guys are here with your boy Jay. Hey y'all, you're also with your girl Amber. And I'm so nervous because <laughs> the two people we have today are absolute legends. Toy Lopez has been making music and art since her punk rock days. And Robert Fripp is known to be one of the most innovative musicians to ever pick up a guitar. Now, We've been asked to react to y'all's music a lot, but we'll do you one better. We have them here with us here in person. So please help us welcome another married couple here to the channel, Ms. Toya Wilcox and Robert Pitt. Welcome to the channel. It is a pleasure to have y'all. Hello. Hello, Jay and Amber. It's an honor to be with you. And I'm Robert. Thank you so, so much for being here. You guys are the very first ones. That has us even more excited, but we are ready to jump into it today. Uh, what song did you guys have for us to, to start out with? Well, Robert's going first. Frame by Frame uh, by King Crimson. This was written and recorded in 1981 by King Crimson on the Discipline album. And the players are Adrian Ballou singing and guitar, Bill Bruford on drums, Tony Levin on stick, Chapman stick, and I'm on guitar. Oh, I am super excited to check it out. You guys heard it. We're going to be checking out frame by frame. Hope you guys are so ready. Make sure before we get into it, though, you all like the video, help keep this channel growing, and we get to have more amazing guests on here. Hit that subscribe button so you are part of the RSR family and that post notification bell so you never miss any of our amazing Rob Squad and the Creator videos. All right, we are ready to check out frame by frame. Let's get it. Okay. That's crazy. It reminds me of the Baba O'Reilly kind of intro. Hey, 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 hey. This is the speed and the cadence of it. That's nuts. Sounds are crazy. <laughs> All right, hold on. The sounds are absolutely insane. Like when it first came in, like it, it was, it was, it was at a lower tone, and like it kind of that tumbling sound. Whenever I hear that tumbling sound, you know, I usually think of uh, Bob O'Reilly by the Who. Now I, now when I hear a tumbling sound, I have a whole other direction to go because this one is way more intense. I feel like than that one, and. 
for you guys, I, I love guitar and bass. That's my two favorite. <laughs> we have instruments. to talk about that guitar. Oh my Go god! Go ahead. <laughs> Oh my god! I, I would love to see it live to see how fast the fingers are going. Because, like I said, I feel like with, matched with that tumbling sound with the electric guitar and the bass at the same time, it it's nuts. It, it, it's it's a lot, but uh, you know, sometimes when you get a lot, it can be overbearing. But this one, it's a lot, but it just fits. Right now, when I read that your style was considered very innovative, I totally get it. It's yeah, I get super it. inventive. It's very like electrifying and i also know that you have written a book um you know over guitar and that totally makes sense because i have never heard somebody play at that speed for that long and it, and it's cool because i like that it's like at a different pace of the heaviness and the cadence that the drums makes so we're going really fast you can catch on with that amazing riff that it's probably impossible to recreate from anybody else but then also you have those heavy drums and the drummer on this and, and is, it comes in with that boom. oh sometimes it's heavy boom. and sometimes it feels cultural like the the overall song you can't you, i love when you can't pin anything to a genre and that's what this is yeah. this is just music and it's cool now my question is how long did it take y'all to come up with that and compose yeah that? put them together uh, about two months wow i'll say it, 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 it had to be something you just kind of just pick and piece and put stuff together because i mean because it's like I said, it sounds innovative. Well, the band uh, the band met and wrote all the material in three weeks. We took it on the road in Europe for three weeks, and then we recorded it in three weeks. Wow. Yeah, that's wow. that's crazy. And, and then how they pieced it together, put everything together. That's, that's what's amazing to me. I was, love the journey. We love being able to see, like, behind the scenes of how songs are created. And, like, I guess I'm just imagining in my head, like, the work y'all are having to do in the studio to come up with these sounds and to put it together. Well, that's, well, gratitude for that. As someone who has listened to Robert play for 38 years within our house, <laughs> um, the, the intensity of the fingers and the speed of the fingers, and sometimes Robert's playing 11 notes a second. Yes. Uh, he practices this oh. for four hours a day, and I can tell you, sometimes it can be hell. But <laughs> other times, it's an absolute inspiration because yeah. he can do it for a long time. 11 yes. notes a second. I mean, listen second. to this song. That's totally believable listen to the way he's playing and, here you know i god i think some of my favorite guitars you know hendrix srv i don't i don't think they were playing 11 notes per second yeah. that's this, that is this wild. is the hand shaken by the hand of Jimi hendrix wow he came that, up well you have to assume these legends would you know guitar wise yeah. would meet well he that's he, that's why he, he came to see the band and came to see us after the first set. He was apparently upstairs saying, this is the best band in the world. And he came down to see us, and he came up to me and said, shake my left hand, man. It's closer to my heart. That is good to take that to the grave for sure. Right, let's get back. Right back into it. We go again. <laughs> He brings a haunting kind of sound to it. See right there. This is incredible. This is incredible. Yeah. <laughs> that 
That drop was cool. Still going. Whoa, the way it ended. With I'm that telling guitar you. isolated. That may be, and not because you guys are on here, one of the coolest things that I've ever heard. Yeah. And like I said, I, I I love guitar, but that right there was, I know that part, the coolest, coolest guitar I've ever heard. And, you know, Eruption was my number one. <laughs> I think I got a bump. I think in Eruption and uh, Eddie Van Halen. But I think I got a bump that one above it because it was just nonstop from start to finish. I would. It's and, all, it, it feels like it, it sounded like impossible, but you were listening to it, but you know it was real, so it's like mind blowing. Do you know how many notes you played through that whole thing? Or, uh, I haven't actually counted the out, but it, it's about nine notes a second in the fast pass. <laughs> See, that's that's like defying like my mind the is laws. literally blown right now. Yeah, and it's crazy because I, as insane as that riff was, I love the way it paired with the, those big moments in the drums. And y'all's lead singer, he has got such See, like a I'm glad. Haunting, haunting voice. When he came in, the way it was he haunting. would hold those notes out, my goodness, I felt like it was going through your whole body. It was amazing. He's got such a great tone to his voice. Man, it has hey. a tension in the voice as well. Yes. What I love about the lyric is the lyric is plaintive, it's romantic, and yet it's really quite painful to the heart it's got all these wonderful kind of contradictions within the whole song that for me make it really exciting as well yeah that was mind-blown we gotta we have dance this weekend so we're gonna be on the road going up to Tulsa my kids are gonna hear this they are, we are gonna play this for them for well, sure and I love that you mentioned the contradiction in in the lyrics because I I also I it was a contradiction that somehow flowed so well the contradiction in the rhythms and in, in the music I love how that paired so well in with the lyrics. It was just, it was beautiful and poetic all together in yeah. so many ways. That is one I, I I will never forget. And that is an absolute honor. Now I I know what everyone's talking about. Legend, I 100% get it. Again, I will, I'll never, for, I'll never forget that one for yeah. sure. So thank you so, so much. And thank both of you for being here with us on the channel today, bringing that just absolute gem to us and real quick before we get out of here uh anything upcoming anything you guys would like to, the fans to know about well within the uk we do a lot of touring and uh, at christmas we go out as robert and tour rob robert and toya Toya and uh, robert. but we've got the festival season <laughs> we have the festival season coming up um, the big festivals we've not quite been announced for, but we're doing the really big festivals, as well as Isle of Wight, which is huge, um, Penfest, and a lot of other really great outdoor events. That we oh, that would be awesome. That would be so much fun. I'll say uh, we, we have a lot of fans over in the UK, so all of you that are over there, make sure y'all stop by and see them listen to the amazing music. If we could, we would definitely be there, but- But hey, you can also just go to their YouTube channel and get a lot of enjoyment there. No well. doubt about it. And we will, I promise y'all, more music will be coming up on the channel. This was such a pleasure and thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. That's gonna be the end of today's episode. As we always send everybody out here on our channel, no matter what channel we have, we always send them out of here the same way. It is we love you, we thank you, we appreciate you. Remember every single day that you guys wake up, it is a blessing and that you are blessed. And for our new family members that joined this amazing, amazing channel, you know, came to watch you guys today. Hey, we appreciate y'all stopping by, but we all have the exact same goal. Let them know, Ma. Let's bet some light, let's bet some love, and let's make somebody smile today. We love you guys. Till next time, we'll see y'all later.